next guest is uh, an actor in the Entourage show, which is a great show. It's on the uh, on the HBO. Uh, the the season premiere is on Sunday, June the twenty seventh. Please welcome very talented Jerry Ferrara, everybody. Jerry Ferrara. <laughs> If, if that chair seems in any way damp, it's not. It's just the the studio is a little moist. Yeah, I was going to thank you for the uh, for the cleanup. Well, yeah, you know, I was cleaning up like Valerie Bertinelli spat on this. <laughs> her, some of her spit is in there. Do you want a drink? It's Valerie Bertinelli weird. spit. That would be weird, though. I think no. All right. Then. Not Tastes weird when you do it. Nailing. It's not weird when you do it. All right. How are you? You good? I'm, uh, I'm pretty good. By the way, how amazing does she look? She looks great. I know. Do you believe? She, doesn't she look sensational? Yeah, I kind of saw her when she's walking back, and I just did like, oh. Yeah. Did yeah. you, uh, did you uh, have a crush on her? I did. Did I you did. really? I had a little crush on her, yeah. Yeah. Did you tell her that? No, no, no. You're not supposed to tell them that, right? Well, not if their fiancés are Sicilian. And Probably it, not. Yeah. By the way, have you ever had two Italians on in one night? Uh, not I on the show, Italian. no. <laughs> uh, well. No, no, no. I, I don't, you know, I don't think we have had two Italians on one night. And I, and I love that. Not Sicilian, though. Not Sicilian. What part of Italy are your family from? You know, I, I, I want to say Calabria, because I remember, like, my grandmother telling me you're, like, Galabrese, which means thick-headed. So right. I kind of think that's the connection. I don't know for sure. Right. <laughs> so we're thinking more Brooklyn? Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, are you from Brooklyn? Really? I am from Brooklyn, but uh, I've been here for uh, 10 years, so uh, I miss the food a lot back there. Really? Yeah. And the, uh, I've never, uh, does the, the steakhouse there in Brooklyn that I went to that's very nice. Peter Luger's. Yes! You yes. love Peter Luger's. They have, they have bacon as thick as a man's head. <laughs> <laughs> the bacon is, uh, is pretty much what they're known for. You know, I mean, there's a restaurant out here that's very similar. What's it called? Wolfgang's. Wolfgang Pucks? No, no, no. Wolfgang's no. Steakhouse. They have the bacon. They kind of do the Luger thing a little bit. Where's that? It's in Beverly Hills. Come on, you've been. I don't go to Beverly Hills. I don't have that kind of money. I'm not an entourage. <laughs> I'm not saying I don't, I don't hang out with Vince and walk up and down. <laughs> We'll go there. We'll yeah, go there one You guys walk up and down a lot in that show. We do a lot of walking you do up a walk, and down. Yeah, you strut up and down and, and live the dream. Walk Is your talks. life anything like that, though, really? No. I mean, uh, I've actually had a couple of days where I've like left set and just been like, I kind of want to go home because that's so much more interesting than my life is. Well, yeah, because, you know, there's lots of sexy girls dancing around in bikinis and everybody wants to have sex with you and then, then you have to go to work. Yeah, and uh, then you got... <laughs> Exactly. Right. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. But uh, no, it's definitely uh, a lot more fun, and um, it's kind of like the element I like most about it is like you always have like your friends around, which is always nice. At 30 years old, you know, I don't live with three dudes like the guys do on the show. But, no, you uh, don't. It's kind of nice to have your uh, your friends around at all times. Do you live with a lady? I don't live with anyone. I live by myself. Really? Yeah. All oh, right. Do you go out to the nightclubs around? In, I uh, uh, <laughs> I'm not one for a nightclub. I had a little run at the beginning of the year because it's kind of something I don't normally do. And I said I'm going to go out and right. just turn 30. I'm like, let me try and have some fun. And uh, it's fun for like a minute. Then you start. Uh, <laughs> I always swore when I was younger. I mean, like you know, 18 years old when I saw like the 30 year old guy in the club. I'm like, man, that guy's creepy. <laughs> So, I know. Nah, you're right, you're right, kid. Yeah, you're right, you're right. <laughs> you know, it, it's true. I don't go. I was in rehab at the time. I was 30, actually. I was stopped going to clubs before even that. Before that? Yeah. Well, I didn't even like clubs when I was drinking. I was like, oh, all these people dancing and noise. I want to get to the bar. Do you dance? No, I don't. I don't Do you I don't, dance? I, I don't dance. No, I don't I dance. wish I did. I wish I did dance a little more. I right? mean, maybe, you know. Maybe we should go dance. You want to go? You want to go to a discotheque? How about that? Yeah, we'll maybe a discotheque. Disco. Yeah, yeah. want to wear some nylon clothing. <laughs> I would pay to see that. Yeah, then we could go to a disco. Do they have '80s discos? I think we. You know what? Let's go to a nightclub, me and you. No, no, they wouldn't let me. And I'd be like the grandpa getting. Out of here. <laughs> hey, look, Jerry's here with his dad. <laughs> hey, everyone, this is my dad. Hey, everybody. Hey. We go to the clubs. Do you guys have any BGs records? <laughs> nah, I don't know, man. I'd feel kind of awkward. Yeah. Good. So, how do you meet girls then if you don't go to the clubs? Um, dog park. Dog park's good. Do you have a dog? I don't have a dog. Well, you gotta get a dog then. I, you know, or uh, borrow one. <laughs> <laughs> I've borrowed dogs before. No, I wish. Uh, how do you meet? Um, I don't. You gotta hope and get. You gotta get lucky. Yeah, you, you ain't gonna um, get lucky staying home watching TV. You know? <laughs> 
Well, you, you are going to get lucky, but in that very limited way. <laughs> It's a tough question. How, yeah, do you, no, how do you meet girls if you don't go out to clubs? And well, stuff I, I don't. Like I'm married. No, it's something worth exploring. I don't know. Yeah. Well, you know, maybe online. Do you, have you got the twitties? You know, I actually, ju I just, uh, <laughs> I just <laughs> <laughs> get the little, to get the little tweeties. I started a couple of days ago, believe it or not. What's your tweety I'm handle? I'm actually following you. Really? I'll follow you back. What's your tweety handles? I am. Uh, what am I? That's <laughs> Jerry. C, and then one of those little underscore things, which right. I don't really know what that is exactly, and right. then my last name, Ferrara. Not that difficult. It sounds pretty complex. But actually. I'm following yeah. you. I'm keeping, uh, I'm keeping an eye on you. Yeah? You've got some pretty interesting tweets. You know, what, what happened today is I think someone's hacked my account. Is been, that true? I wanted yeah, to ask you about yeah, that. Yeah, I think someone's been tweeting stuff that I haven't said. It's me. I, I, is it you? It's me, yeah. That's awesome. I figured out how to do it. You're but much that, funnier than me. Will you keep going? I wanted to kind of <laughs> step it up. No, I, saw, I finally got a chance to see your stand-up. Where? I was at the, uh, the Bob Saget's uh, the charity event for uh, Skeleton. Uh, I can't even pronounce oh, it. Oh, Skeleton. Yes, thing? thank yeah. you. And I saw you, uh, I saw you perform. Fantastic job. Well, thanks very much. That's, that's why we want to follow you. Yeah, but, well, the, it's funny that because no, when Bob, you know Bob Saget, obviously, then, because he's been on Entourage. He's been on the yeah. show before, Bob. Yeah. yeah, Bob's great. He is. He's, what people don't, often, a lot of people don't understand about Bob is how profane and filthy he is. Uh, that is an understatement. Of yeah. The he, I mean, really, it's, it's like having a, a kind of 10-year-old with Tourette's around <laughs> with you. Uh, yeah, he, can't, he fit right in on uh, Yeah, I know, I imagine, yeah. Yeah. I must get in touch with Bob, actually. I haven't seen him since then. You should. Yeah. I'm happy I could uh, come here and bring that out for Maybe you. me, you, and Bob can go to a disco, because Bob's I, older than me. I mean, <laughs> I would like nothing better than this Friday night. Me, you, Saget, we go out. I can't go Friday night, you know why? Saturday night. No, I can't go Saturday night. Where are you going? Go to the Bahamas this weekend. Look Do you, you. Know, why? you know why? Why are you going to the Bahamas? I'm going shark diving. You're kidding. No. Why? Because I'm awesome. <laughs> I'm going shark diving. I mean, that's terrifying. Sound like, you know, I'm, diving, I'm diving with the shark. I'm doing a little cage. show for one of the cable networks. Do you know one of the cable yes. networks has a week every year? Yes. Where they celebrate the work of sharks? <laughs> yes. So you're participating in the, the week of the shark? The week of the shark okay. on the network that must not be named. <laughs> to be named later. To right. be named later. It'll be a discovery when we find out. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> Sorry, man. Sorry. Are you, are you not nervous at all, though? You're, like, excited for this. No, I'm crapping my pants. I was about to say, because I'd be terrified. Dude, it's sharks! I'd be sharks! <laughs> I mean, some, have you, you ever you... dived with a Have you ever been down there with a shark? Uh, no, I don't even dive in a swimming pool. <laughs> you can't swim? I could swim, but I, I'm not gonna... No, shark. I mean, that's crazy. I know. Wanna come? No. I'll come watch and document and laugh and pray you don't get eaten. <laughs> no, if you come, you have to get in the war. They're paying you good, right? No, 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 no it's no. cable. <laughs> it's worse than I, CBS. I, I, would no, I, I would not in a million years. All right, then. Well, you can come back on this show, then. Uh, if I live, if do, do you want to come back? Uh, I think it would be rude not to, if you live. Right. <laughs> I'm rooting for you. Are you? Yeah, I mean, I don't want to see on your Twitter... Uh, Craig's All right, died. so I'll, I'll tweet you after the shark dive on Keep Saturday. Me I'll, the, yes. I'll, I'll tweet you, I'll let you know if I make it. Excellent. All right. Good luck. If, the, if it's typing slow, you'll know what's happened. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Jerry Ferraro, everybody. Be very right back. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Jerry Ferraro, everybody. Good to be back. It's nice to see you, pal. We haven't been around in a while. Yeah, well, the last time I was here, yeah. you were about to go shark diving. Yeah, yeah, I went, yeah. I'm happy you survived. Do I, me too. I'm glad you're not dead because I kind of, when I said goodbye to you, I was like... You thought I was going to die. Goodbye, Craig. Yeah, because that was the night before I went the on the shark. I, was, I know, and you were, you were freaking me out. I remember now. You were kind of like, yeah. oh, you're going to die. I think and I even I was, sent out a tweet that night. Yeah, like, yeah. Craig is really a good guy. I'll, re I'll remember him. Yeah, I will Very, miss. very good life. I, I hope his limbs are recovered <laughs> from the shark. Yeah, so, but it's good to be back. Thank you That's for having nice. me back. Well, Have you ever been shark diving? No. You should go. Never. I loved it. 
I don't have that in me. I have a problem. Like when I was a little kid, I used to actually imagine that Jaws would come through the filter of the pool and was gonna eat me. Well, in Florida, what they do is they come up from the beach and they will follow you into the drugstores. It's true. Yeah. Do you uh, uh, do you uh, celebrate uh, this day? Oh, 420? Yeah. Um, no. 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 Okay. Okay. I'm not. A little bit. Uh, no. It's um. It's uh. It's a. It's a cool day. <laughs> nah. It's fine. Um, so listen, you kept it way off, man. You're in great shape. I'm trying to. Yeah, are, a, you, uh, are you uh, working out all the time? Like you feel very hard. Well, I play basketball now. You play basketball. I play in a. I won't call it a basketball league because it's a little more pickup, but uh, twice a week. Yeah. And uh, we guys are getting hurt like crazy. <laughs> it's bad. Um, Some guy no, broke his not, arm the other night. I, I don't. I don't mean to be in any way uh, disparaging about your basketball playing. <laughs> But I've had a couple of basketball players on here, and uh, you're, you're physically a little different. <laughs> well, the last game I played, and I actually did something really dumb that hurt my physical gifts, let's say, that I don't have. Uh, you know, being that I'm a little bit older and I'm not really adjusting well to pain that I'm in after the game, I started taking Advils and stuff before the game. Can you say that? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I saw, okay, I saw it take, anyway, they make a PM version of that. Oh, yeah, they I do, inadvertently yeah. took two of the PMs, <laughs> walked into my basketball yeah. game, and I'm like, God, I'm really tired of no. that, guys. I could, like, the ball hit me off the face, yeah. Listen, I can't tell you the amount of times I've taken that and then been hit in the face by a ball. <laughs> All right, over and over and over again. Happy birthday, Don Mattingly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. You a big sports fan? You follow a lot of different things. I do. I'm a, I'm a huge, uh, huge sports fan. Yeah. All right. So, what are you like? Basketball? Who do you follow in basketball? I'm a Lakers Knicks, fan. I'm a Knicks fan. Knicks I'm fan. I'm a devout New York fan in all, uh, all sports. Do you ever, do you ever go down to the Lakers game when you're here and see all these other agents? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been to a couple of Laker games and. Um, I kind of hate the Lakers because they have been so good as a mm. franchise, and I've the Knicks are the only franchise I've never seen win a championship in my generation. So I kind of hate the Lakers for that reason, in a good way. In a good, I hate them because they win. Yeah, no, it's all right. We, yeah. you know, I mean, it's fine. There's a lot of people in here from LA, though, man. You might want to just like be careful. <laughs> These people will. Well, they're from LA. They don't care. Yeah. What about uh, what about football in New York? What do you follow there? Uh, I'm a big Giants fan. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. I had the pleasure of winning another uh, Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. And um, do you ever go to a Super Bowl? You know what? <laughs> I went to the Super Bowl two years ago. I've actually had the chance to go for both Giant Super Bowls, and I said no because Why? I couldn't handle it. All right. Because okay. I need to scream, yell, which most fans do, but I need to throw things. Like I have my kitchen. That's, no, that's illegal. That's illegal. My kitchen in my in my house, I call the locker room, and if right. something doesn't go my way, I go inside and wreck the locker room. Like start throwing. St yeah. You I'm married? Right. Nope. No, you're not. I wonder why that is. Yeah, no. Let me tell you something. When you get married, you ain't going into the locker room. Right? <laughs> The locker room's gonna be yeah. outside the in the garage. Room is or like, yeah, you no, you just watch the game. You're like happy to do it. And that's fine. <laughs> no, I'm single. Right? Yeah, yeah. Well, absolutely single. Like, Absol like absolutely single. Yeah. Wow, that must be quite a fun time for you. I'm just not good at. It. I don't know. Really? I was hoping maybe you could like. I, don't, I need. Well, man, I'm married with kids. I'm go like, go back. Like, what was your like approach? I need like an approaching line to break the ice. I just pretended to be Scottish. It seems to work. <laughs> Okay, maybe I should work on my Yeah, accent. no, you just go, you know, in my country, I don't understand. What are breasts? And then... <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> what is this thing you American girls have? Uh, vagina. What is that? Uh, Something tells me if I said that with my Brooklyn accent, <laughs> I get punched in the face. <laughs> Listen, you say that with any accent, you're going to get punched in the face. Right. In the face. Yeah. No, it's, uh, it doesn't really work. I don't know. I, I think having a set pickup line is a bad idea. I, just, just be yourself, be honest, and listen to what girls are saying. <laughs> I can't even I finish it. I did see a friend of mine, a friend of mine in full confidence, we were at a bar one night and literally says, watch this. And I watch, he walks over to this girl, asks her for a number and says, but only give me seven numbers. Wait, three, I'm sorry, six numbers. Six numbers, yeah. <laughs> only give me six and I'll guess the other one. And she was kind of, I don't know, she thought that was a good idea. Right. Gave him the six numbers. It's like. 
Okay, so you have to make nine phone calls to figure out what the last digit is. I don't right, right. see the creativity. Well, that's because now what she, what he is saying to her is that I'm prepared to walk through hell to get to you. <laughs> to go or at least make nine phone calls. Nine phone yeah, calls. Yeah. He'll probably text all nine different options. Is this you? Is this you? Yeah. He'll text them all. Yeah, of course. You wouldn't call. No, that's no. ridiculous. But you know what? Here's one, here's one that, uh, that I heard that I thought was awesome. Okay. It actually was done to me by a girl. Oh. See, that never happens. I gotta get a better accent. Let's hear it. It was really good, though. It was really good, right? It was a long, <laughs> oh, clearly a long time ago. But she, I, I stopped at this uh, traffic light, and she pulled up next to me, and there was a bunch of girls in the car, so we were egging each other on, right? They wind down the window, and one of them said, I forgot my telephone number. And I went, all right. She said, can I have yours? <laughs> That's pretty cute, isn't that cute? Yeah. Yeah. And I said, yeah. <laughs> Which and then they drove away. What was uh, yours? Oh, it's a creepy old man! It's a creepy old man! <laughs> yeah, it doesn't happen to me. No, no, it, it, it happened in a dream I had. Well, if you see me with a black eye, it's because I tried that line. Hey, 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 the movie looks good. Ah, uh, the movie is good, thank right, you. Great, right. uh, great. Yeah. All right, so, uh, we're out of time. We're good job. Good job. Yeah. Mouth organ, awkward pause, big cash prize. I'm a big fan of the awkward pause. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> He's a very talented actor. He's a good friend of the show. He's adorable and he smells like biscuits. <laughs> Do you? No. Okay. <laughs> I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> Jenny Ferrara, everybody. Jenny Ferrara. Great, man. You, I mean, you look great. You really kept the, the in shape thing going on. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm miserable. No. <laughs> and you don't smell like biscuits at all. You smell like some kind of expensive cologne. That's that? just my musk, right? Really? It's just my musk, yeah. It smells a bit like Ashton. <laughs> <laughs> Would you ever have your own cologne? You could do that. Actors do that. No, I mean, I don't think anybody wants to smell like me. Well, I'd rather smell like you than a Kardashian, dude. I think, <laughs> I think it'd be good. Gonna join in with you on yeah, that Yeah, I like, they seem, they're kind of clappy tonight, so I'm just going to join in. How have you been? I haven't seen you in a while. What have you been up to? I, uh, I've been good. I've been out of town a lot. I've been, Where have you uh, been? Travel. I've been working uh, in Atlanta, in New Mexico, stopped in New York for Christmas, so... Uh, I like New York. I don't know if you knew this about me, but I used to live there. <laughs> Never knew that, actually. Yeah, yeah, that's Never. where I learned how to play Ultimate Frisbee. Is that where... By the way, your form looks fantastic. Yeah, thanks very much. I'm a little rusty. I can tell you, yeah. you, you back in your day, you were... Oh, well, back in the day, when, when Frisbee was badass, <laughs> before it went all corporate, man. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but yeah, a lot of planes. I've been in an airport uh, a lot, and you, I'm happy you, to. You, not. Are you a good flyer? Are you flying? You're frightened to fly, and I remember that about you. Yeah, we've discussed this before. Yeah, yeah you've got to learn to fly. I mean, I, I literally been on 20 flights in the last six, seven weeks, and I just feel like I'm losing a little bit of my life every time I go. No, it's man, like yeah. shortening up. You got to. It's a toll. Yeah, I know. I understand. I used to be like that too. You got to turn it around. You got to turn it around. You're, you're not afraid to fly. You're just a control freak. Deal with it. Well. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, the one thing I had to do, which I was not proud of, was uh, on a connecting flight, I really had to brush my teeth bad, so I went in an airport bathroom and brushed my teeth. Never thought I'd do that. Some guy next to me was shaving, so he kind of had to... I'm glad you said shaving. I was shaving. Like, Sh oh, shaving. Oh, shaving. yeah. yeah. Kind of felt like, I was like, oh, like okay. Tom Hanks in the terminal at one yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. You know the, uh, the airport bathrooms, it's the noises I can't handle. You go in there and you're like, oh, really, really? Is that all? There's a lot in those videos. Well, the noise is another uh, senses. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Maybe you could help me get over this fear. because I can't help you get over the fear of flying. You learn to fly. Go and learn to fly an airplane. Now, it'll be terrifying, and 
but... Like, to actually operate one? Mm -hmm. Get a pilot's license. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lucky I got a driver's license. No, 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 I'm telling you, that's, this is the way forward for you. You get in a plane, and you learn how to fly it. And you learn about, you learn about especially these big air, the airliner things that you're on. Come on, man. It's like getting on a bus. That's not going anywhere. It's like... No, nah, I've been saying, like, the same prayer since I was eight years old. And um, it's getting kind of weird because, like, I don't want to actually show that I'm saying a prayer. So I try to be all cool, and I'm in my seat, and I'm just, I'll just be like... So bored to be on this plane. Inside, I'm saying a prayer where I'm basically in tears. <laughs> that I've been repeating. But I try to look cool playing. Can, play can it you up. repeat it? Can you say the prayer? I just hope that if I say it out loud, I've never said it out loud to any of the humans, that it still works. <laughs> but uh, remember, you I got some real OCD. How are you, my devil? Crikey. No, on, I really. Man. It's the only only pattern I have. I really don't have any kind of routine or pattern with anything else. In All right, life. just the flying. Just the flying, yeah. but um, it's pretty ridiculous. I'll, I mean, this will be the first time I've ever said it. Well, do you want to say it, or maybe I don't want to? Let's wanna... go for it. Like, right. Maybe it'll help me get a little bit. Uh -huh. Remember, I was eight. I was eight. Yeah, you know, okay. You haven't adapted this in any way since I you were eight. You look, listen to the unselfishness. Do you, want some, do you want a little music underneath it? If you, sure, let's do it. Yeah, you want a little music? A little... Okay. Now, remember, I'm trying to look cool and bored. God, please keep us safe. Please keep myself, the pilots, and the passengers safe. Please let us have a nice, normal, uneventful flight to insert your city there, JFK. Uh, if you could do that for me, I'd really appreciate it, and I'll be good from this point on. I promise. <laughs> Thanks. The music adds so yeah, much to good. it. Yeah, it does. So much. Kind of worked out a little bit. So much. Now I'm I just, think that's a lovely prayer. Nothing wrong with that. I'm just scared. I a little bit of insurance loud. on the way up. That's all right. We I had, mean, I'm a pilot, dude, but I would, if I had that prayer, I'd be like, yeah, okay. That, I'm, I'm in with all of that. So that's fine. You're fine with turbulence. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I can still get right. I mean, heavy turbulence, you still get a little, ugh. I had please. some bad turbulence, and, like, I, when I look at the person sitting next to me, like, the ideal situation is give me a little calm and a little fear. I had this one guy who was just, like, reading the paper like he couldn't be more bored as we were just, like, going like this. Yeah. And he's got the sports section open, and I'm looking at him, like, just react. Yeah. React. Yeah. And then when the flight was finally over, he's like, whew, that was a close one, huh? Yeah. So, you well, that's how he's on. dealing with his fear. He's like, oh, God, please get me safe. You get yeah. my pilot safe. I'm a rock. If you look at me yeah. and we're having bad turbulence, I'll just be like... <laughs> yeah. No, I cry. <laughs> <laughs> Which is unnerving for the passengers when I'm flying the plane. I, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm sure uh, yeah. not good. I did, I did make a mistake, too, and I brought the screener of flight and watched Oh, what the, the hell? That's a stupid thing to do. I thought it would help me with the fear. No, it will not help you with the fear. All right, we're out of time. Uh. Quiet moment? Could tell, yeah, I, awkward, you know, pa awkward pause, quiet moment? I love, I love the awkward pause. Awkward pause, oh, awkward exactly. pause. All right, smell my finger, awkward pause? Sure, sure. I'm reintroducing it. Would you like to smell your own finger? Would you like to smell my finger? I'm going to smell you like, yours. You smell my finger? Yeah. Okay, whoa, well, yeah. <laughs> Well, we're in then, aren't we? Yeah, so. Are you good? Very well, thank you. Good. I saw you on the Entourage. I watched that show. Did you? The Entourage? Yes, I watched the Entourage with the, all these lovely... <laughs> the boys. Yes, yes. They're all quite small. Um, you can't comment on no, that, but I've no. noticed that they are. Yes. Whenever they're all together, I want to just, you know, give them Cuddle a hug. Them. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah they are lovely. You know, but you're